People finding out I was crocheting a tapeworm was certainly interesting. I mean, you're gonna laugh, you're gonna cry. People also thought it looked kind of cute. My submission was the Very Hungry Tapeworm. This is a knitted Australian bush leech that I made. As you can see, it's infected this unhappy little red blood cell here. Here we have um, my picture book that I've made called Mikey's Malaria Misadventure. The tapeworm didn't eat the N acetylmuramol L alanyl D isoglutaminyl N beta D asparaginyl L lysyl D alanyl D alanine diphosphoyl undecaprinyl N acetylglucosamine from the watermelon. I made a series of five miniature cakes representing the five main stages of the blood phase of malaria. We set out to create like a late night talk show where we had a human host who was interviewing two parasitic guests. I did a suite of poems called uh, Sweet Inside. Spleen and liver, tis visceral within, drugs and vector control, must do until. It won't kill me. I'm not blood passing through spleens. Vicious vivax, outrageous ovale. My dad thought it was quite funny. My mum thought it was probably less funny. Leeches are awesome and people should learn more about them. Probably when you're not infected by them, they can have some cute aspect. Kind of depends on the parasite. These ones are just way cuter. Underneath the microscope though, the real ones, no. This is like Nobel winning stuff.